Hello. So I just want to show you a little script I've made and I've put this on GitHub. It's a public domain script, so you can use it in any project. Doesn't matter what licensing you're using. And it's just a simple key switcher, which I think is something that's uh, sort of wanted by a lot of people. And it's something I've just needed for a project. So I thought I'd make a simple one that we can put in any project that we need. So this is a script. I'm not going to go into details about how it works, but that's it. It's just those two blocks of code. There's not a lot to it. Um, it's very generic. You insert it into a sampler. So it goes at the sampler level. It won't work at like uh, if, you, if you put it in the container or um, the master container, it's not going to work there. You have to put it in the sampler. It works on group based articulations. So, or well, it doesn't have to be articulations, but whatever you're switching, they have to be in separate groups. So I've got six groups and each one has a separate uh, sample set. So you set this first knob here to the number of groups you have. So six in my case. And you set this second knob here to the note number that you want to be the first key switch. So I've set it to 24, which is um, this C down here. So that's uh, what's that? two below middle C, three below middle C. It will automatically color the keys. And if you change these, it will move the key switches around and you can change the number of groups. So let me just show you in action. So I'll um, press the key switch. And now we'll press another key switch. And another key switch. So it's really nice, um, simple to use. Just drop it in and it'll work for these more uh, simple instruments that don't have a lot of complex requirements in their articulation switching and group management and that kind of thing. All right, thank you for watching. I hope you found this useful. Any questions or comments, let me know. I'll put a link directly to this script in the video description and also alongside the post on Patreon. That's all for now. See you next time.